one go and go and people them. So this is like fresh, 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 fresh out the kitchen. Um, because this is something that uh, Miss Chloe Bailey has dropped today. So um, I didn't even know that she had a second album that was coming out. Obviously, I knew that she'd have something that was uh, that would that would follow up from her first album, which I absolutely loved. I know that the, it had you know a bit of like mixed reviews from a lot of people and stuff, but having actually seen her performing live and stuff in concert last year, like I loved it. I thought it was absolutely brilliant. I, I, I just so many different types of sounds on there that I really appreciated anyway, and so many like just bops as well, like just actual bops. Bops, 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 bops. That was just my opinion anyway. But um, yeah, one of my um, subscribers, thank you, Miss Brianda, um, did send me um, a Instagram message yesterday to say, by the way, just, just, just FYI, Chloe Bailey is dropping some music tonight. Tonight. Um, so what I'm going to do, because I've got to run some errands in a little while, but when I get back, I'm going to do the full album um, reaction and, and pop that on my Patreon. Um, but this is like one of the songs that have come up as one of the visualizers. That I'm guessing she's done a certain amount of visualizers for the album. I don't know if she's done one for each song. She could have done one for each song, maybe. Um, but I'm going to have a look and I'm going to see whether or not this one... I mean, I did see one with her uh, and YG Marley. Um, and I'm like, oh, shall I do that one as the first one? But this is the this this is the first one that actually came up, which is um, somebody, um, yeah, somebody. So let's give this a watch. Oh, this is track 16. I should have gone for track number one. It's four in the morning. I'm drinking. I think of us. If I call, will you answer? Are you with her? Am I good enough? My love is stronger than ego. And I'm looking down. My cards down. If yours is the morning. Cause baby, I. 
It's in. That's a vibe. That's a vibe. That's a vibe. Right, we'll come back to this. So, Trouble in Paradise is the name of the album, right? Okay. Okay, 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 okay. That, on its own, has already got me very much in the zone that I need to react to all of this album. Like, post-haste. Post-haste. Yo, that's a beat, man. You give me a beat like that that I can literally wind up myself to. Yo, that's me all day. All day. Love it. Um, I really like the visualizer as well. I think, like, I mean, I mean that could have been a music video for me because um, I think there were some visualizers that I see where it's, it's like a loop. So it's just something to watch. But that seemed to, like, go through the whole the whole song. Um, so I'm not saying there probably won't be a music video at some point, but for me, that's fine. That was almost giving, like, Ariel part two. Do you know what I mean? We've now got both Bailey sisters all up in the water with the, with the hair just flowing in the, in the, in, in the sea, in the sand. And, you know, like, she's so beautiful, man. Like, I've, I've seen some really, like, ugly, ugly ass comments on the internet about, um, Chloe Bailey. And Honey Bailey, actually. Um, but... I love the fact that like the love, the the outpouring of love to me drowns out all of that. Um, and as well, how much love she's got for herself. Do you know what I mean? Like how she loves her curves, how she loves like you know what she stands for, and not letting people kind of dictate to her what she should or shouldn't do. Um, you just gotta respect someone that sta that stands ten toes down uh, with their art and their craft. Um, and to me, is able to deliver like I mean that's a butt to me. And and like lyrically. I mean, yeah, a lot of a lot of her songs can kind of have that kind of grown feel to it. I know that I was definitely, and, and I presume these are coming from like her autobiographical moments of her life, but like there does seem to be a lot of like relationshipy stuff in there, like and you know, um, you know, having that kind of intimacy with another person, or you know, um, relationship woes where someone is stepping out on a relationship, or but I think she has been through those kind of things, so you know, people. People talk about what they know, right? So I'm I'm not angry about that. Um, the the need of having someone like I just need somebody, do -do -do -do, and I don't need somebody. I'm sure we've all been in situations where you know you would probably just want that person. Like if if you are if that person is meant to be your person, like you know while the while everything's going on in the world, it'd be great just to have that embrace and stuff. Um, it did make me laugh though. Which is like you know I'll meet you in the lobby like. This is this is some ASAP situation. Like, I need to wrap up with someone now. <laughs> so I write that. I write that. Um, but again, I like the idea of just you know having that mode where you just like I just I just want that. I want that physical embrace. And you know, not everybody has the capacity to kind of find those people. Do you know what I mean some people have been on their own for a very long time? Um, other people conversely will have a different person in their bed every night. Um, you know, but I think that that want, regardless of what camp you're in, I think it's a totally human thing to to yearn for. Do you know what I mean? So I, I I'm I'm rocking with it, man. I think that's a vibe. I think that's a vibe. I think it's a vibe. I, I love it. Um, I'd love to know what you guys thought of this. Um, have you listened to the album yet? Um, like I said, I'm probably gonna do that reaction tonight. So um, when I get back from uh, getting my hair cut, um, I will probably come back and do the full album and just hear what the album got to say. Like for me, like I said. Um, the first album she did uh, was amazing um, and I really, really enjoyed it. All of it. I thought, I, I, like, from start, I found it really difficult to find a song I didn't like. Um, so it'd be interesting to see how that compares to this uh, this album. I mean, so far, if that's the song that she finishes with, I, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of hopeful for what I'm about to listen to, to be honest. So, um, but yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll watch it together and we'll, and we'll, and we'll see how we find it at the same time. Um, for now though, if you did enjoy this, then please do drop me a like and subscribe. That'd be amazing. Thank you so much. Um, and if you do want to go one step further and you want access to my reactions before they come to uh, YouTube, some of which never come to YouTube because it's just really hard for these type of reactions are really difficult because like music is copyrighted so much so um yeah if you didn't want my full reactions then please do head over to patreon 
it's a great way to help support the channel as well uh, because again that's another reason why um, it's really difficult to uh, to earn that much on YouTube because of this copyrighted music and that kind of stuff so if there's any kind of support you want to throw my way I'd be really 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 grateful but for now thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you on well I hope to see you a little bit later <laughs> peace and love Thank you.